uh, what what do we mean when we say that no good playwright will write scenes full of exposition? What are we really talking about? What we're talking about is two characters in a scene who both share some history or know something. They both know this something is true, uh, but the audience doesn't know it. And so the playwright just puts information into people's mouths. You remember um, when we were 12 and you stole my notebook and I had to sit in detention because Mrs. Fournier, my math teacher, thought I didn't do the homework? Okay, that whole thing that I just said, I was talking to my sibling. My sibling, she knew the whole story, of course. We were both there. Why am I saying this? I'm saying this because I have been hijacked by a nervous playwright, an anxious playwright, who is worried that the audience will be confused and needs to know every little detail. Generally speaking, this is always true in the theater. When we sit in the dark in the, the audience, we are first and last interested in the emotional truth of the dynamics between individuals, between characters. So I am more interested in tracking the emotional truth of whatever's going on between these two people than I am in knowing, was it Tuesday or was it Wednesday when the betrayal happened? I don't care. I know that a betrayal happened, and that's what's important, and I know how they are feeling about it right now in the scene. Okay, so we, whenever we find that a character is um, protecting us, making sure we have all the pieces of the puzzle, we are in danger because part of the experience of being in the audience is participating by putting together the pieces of the puzzle. It is a delicate balance. You do not want people to be so lost that they give up trying to put together the puzzle. But you must keep them actively engaged from beginning to end in piecing together bits of this puzzle. Otherwise, the play ceases to be their play. And our goal should always be that the audience believes that we are helping them and they are putting together a story that is unfolding in front of them and that they and they alone are putting it all together. In this way, when a person is really engaged in a play, they feel a kind of ownership. They are invested, so invested in what's going on on stage because they are adding up the equations. Okay, enough for now. <laughs>